Hey everyone, welcome to another episode. I'm Menti, and this is episode seven of the Tank Tussle Season Five Tournament. In this episode, we've got the Pirate Detachment by Pyrotech, which consists of the Carmeta Fara tank destroyers, going up against the Ant Lions by Cheese Bags. With the toe biters in the stingy pants. So, the Carmetta Faras are firing 386 millimeter AP heat, while the Antlions have 175 millimeter AP HE. So, this is going to be a battle of the penetrators. Let me go ahead and get the predictions started. Why? Oh, okay, there. Pyre or Antlions. Prediction has begun. You've got one minute to place your bets. Let's get this started. Landship tournament win. Well, I wanted to have a landship tournament this time, but then everybody was like, no, we need multiple tanks. And so I settled on the, the two... Uh structurally identical idea well it wouldn't have been 25k if it was land ships doom agent <laughs> Ooh. Is Stingy Pants dead? No, nope, still seems to be alive, but its turret has been blown off. Yeah, that's what AP Heat does. It's not, it's like, I mean, but it is AP heat, so it's like, each shot isn't doing a huge amount of damage until it does. I think the gun might be disabled, though. That looks like microbarrelitis. Oh yeah, I guess I could just check the firepower. Yeah. <laughs> the gun is gone. Hey, that missile hit. Knocked off a couple of uh, triangle corners. Stingy Pants is almost dead. It's been hollowed out. And there it goes. Dead. Where was that shot going?
Yeah, those magazines are still loaded. All it takes is a couple heat fragments and kaboom. Yep, there was the kaboom, and Tobiter is dead. 97.9 to 0. That's a lot of damage just to start out with, <laughs> including engine damage it looks like. Oh, that looks like a gun detonation, yep. The turret's still attached, but I don't think that gun is functional anymore. Barely. 0 0.31 firepower. It's basically dead. Don't know why this gun isn't firing. It has the firepower still. Oh, there it goes. It fired a shot. Bonked off a few blocks. Nope, Tobiter has died. Oh, that was an overpen. Oof, that's a rough hit. Looks like some gun damage. And kaboom, and Stingy Pants is dead. 96-9-0. Alright. Round three, here we go. You know what vehicle the pirate attack or the what entry the pirate attachment would really hate to come up against? BRM's land ships. AP Heat is not going to do so well against those. That missile's trying real hard to hit the enemy, but 
just not getting there. Yeah, it's always kind of funny to watch AP Heat because it's like it doesn't do a whole lot of damage, doesn't do a whole lot of damage, suddenly destroys the entire tank. <laughs> Very golden BB. This thing seems to be having trouble getting its gun on target a bit, or well, facing the enemy. Its gun's getting on target just fine, actually, because it's got some really large, uh, what you call it? Is that uh, azimuth? Is it azimuth? I forget. Yeah. The barrel aims quite far to the sides. <laughs> oh, and there goes Stingy Pants' turret. Less terrain occlusion? What do you mean? Just that this is smoother? Or just less... Or... That this hill... Is not as rough. Ah, uh, okay. Gotcha. Oh, seems like both the antlions have lost all their turrets again. <laughs> yeah, I... I realized what that I said what I said as soon as I said it BRM I was just hoping nobody else would notice <laughs> Oh stingy pants is dead too damaged Yeah, th you know what? You're right. This is technically a second turret right here. So, yeah. <laughs> and Toe Biter is too damaged.
97.2 to 0. Yes, very dominant victory for Pyrotech. Yeah, I, I don't know. Prediction has been awarded. But yeah, I don't know why Pyro, Pyrotech's tanks just suddenly shoot for the moon sometimes. Whatever the case, it was more than enough to take down the antlions. <laughs> Took a bobby. <laughs> Anyway, that'll be the end of this episode, folks. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you on the battlefield.